All right, here we are. We're going to set up the Sonic Cleaner. We have a Sonic Cleaning solution that you can buy. I poured a little bit in there already. We're going to take our DI water, fill it up to the minimum line there at the back. We have a small um, batch, so we don't need a whole lot of water in there. We dump it in a little basket. We're going to put them in. Set the timer. I figure 10 minutes with this amount. We'll turn the heat on too. Turn them on. Put the lid. This will take about 10 minutes. Um, I'm not going to talk the whole time, but I'm going to walk through a little bit of this process with the sonic cleaner. Um, so once we uh, run them through this, they're going to come out of here. We're going to rinse them with DI water. I have some remaining DI water in this, so I'll dump them into this. We're going to rinse off whatever remaining uh, cleaning solutions on them and then we'll set them outside on a towel to dry. That's about the only downside with the Sonic Clean is they end up, you end up with wet cases but you have to dry them but still if you have some sunlight set it out in the sun it doesn't take long. Half hour, an hour, you're still well ahead of the time you would be, have spent using a media tumbler. You know, like I said, that took about six hours to get what this can get clean in about 25 minutes. And then with a half hour of drying time, you're, oh, you're under an hour and your cases are ready to go. If you want to speed that time up, I use a little fan. I lay the brass cases out on a, a dry towel, set the fan up, and let it blow on them. That will speed up the process. So we'll go ahead, um, wait till these are finished. I'll come back to you when I'm pulling these out. We'll get those out. I'll kind of show you how I lay them out real quick to dry them. And then we'll move on to the next step of case prep, which will be the chamfer, deburr, and pocket primer pocket cleaning. And for that, I'm going to use this, the RCBS case prep station. Uh, the Hornaday Lock and Load set comes with a handheld device with these two um, pieces on a little handheld bit. Um, it's okay for starting, it's okay for small batches, but if you're going to be doing hundreds of rounds, it wears on your hands quite quickly, and it's time consuming. This little guy, plug it in, turn it on, everything rotates, we'll knock him through, it just takes minutes. So I recommend an investment like this, it's 100 bucks, well worth your hands. So we'll go ahead and uh, break for now, I'll come back when uh, seven minutes is up and I'll pull these out and I'll show you the rest of the process.